many people are actually let into that ballroom at the Hotel Roanoke that the temperature rose to more than 80 degrees. So that was one problem, but also so many tickets were sold that a lot of people waited for hours in line and in the end had nothing to show for it. But that's what made the overall reaction even more impressive. Everyone I spoke to, even the ones who didn't end up going inside, say that they were just excited that the potential next president of the United States of America visited their city. The day began for many waiting, almost like a family, for their presidential hopeful to land at the airport. We're hoping that he sees that nothing has, nothing can really change this city's for Trump and Trump only. Cut your taxes and no more crazy regulations, okay? And once people had the chance to hear their candidate of choice, I'm even more pro-Trump now than I was before. After hearing Donald Trump speak, Cindy Young says she couldn't be more confident in her pick for president. Just the energy, the energy that's in the room, and he's just so different. He isn't a politician. He's a businessman, and that's what we need, is someone that won't have somebody in their back pocket. And speaking with others who attended the rally, Young isn't alone. He is very dynamic. He is really wants to help the people. I mean, it was just so obvious. Mm -hmm. Many say it's his stance on issues that affect them that won them over. My main reason for being here is to hear what Mr. Trump had to say about the coal people. The people in the coal industry are suffering very much. And I like what he said about he's going to bring coal back. Even those like Joseph Lawborn, who dressed up and waited an hour only to be told the room was at capacity, are still in high spirits. I love Mr. Trump. Uh, I think he'll be a great asset to our nation. I just hate Hillary for one thing. As Young left the ballroom in the Hotel Roanoke, she spoke for hundreds of others in her reaction to the candidate's first official campaign stop. We're pro-Trump all the way. Well, Trump and Mike Pence also held another rally in Winston-Salem, North Carolina, to kick off their very first day of campaigning together. In downtown Roanoke, Rob Manch, WSLS 10.